Get ready for an audio vacation. Created for those who enjoy cruising, the cruise industry, and even ocean liners of the past. Pull in the gangway, bring up the anchor, drop all lines to shore. Together, we'll embark on a voyage with the voice of the cruise industry, America's cruise director, the doctor of cruising, your advocate for adventure, and the host of Cruising Authority at CruiseTalkShow.com. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome aboard. And now, presenting your host for the most listened to cruise related talk show anywhere, Barry Vaudrin. Those were the powerful whistles aboard the Queen Mary 2 that you just heard in our intro. Well, you're watching Cruising Authority at CruiseTalkShow.com. I'm your host, and this is our first video. And uh, I just wanted to take you behind the scenes and show you some of the engine rooms that I've had the opportunity to visit over the years. The first one we're going to take a look at is aboard the Celebrity Solstice. We went into the control room first. The chief engineer was gracious enough to show his, his powerful engines. And so let's take a look at those engines now. Very technical. I also visited the engine room of the Eurodam. I spent some time interviewing for Cruising Authority the chief engineer of the Eurodam in the control room, which was really fascinating. And then we went down and looked at the mighty engines of the Eurodam. Here's a short clip of that. Well, I'm really excited to show you our next clip, our final clip of an engine room. Um, but before I do that, I want to show you a short clip of the engine room aboard the Norwegian Pearl. As you can see, these engine rooms are just big rooms with huge engines in them. Uh, mostly they're diesel. But I want to show you something that not a lot of people see anymore, and that is the engine room of the Sea Breeze, which was a steam turbine driven vessel. Uh, back in 1999, I took a cruise aboard the Sea Breeze and ventured down into the boiler room, engine room, and met with the chief engineer. And we had quite the adventure because it was hot down there. And uh, you'll get to see the boiler room and the control area in the engine room area and you'll be able to see the big drive shaft it was really cool a buddy of mine and i uh, went down there and saw the engines and the boilers of the sea breeze take a look at that video should we go down and check the engine room Control room. And it's 
Show us guess. how the ship works. Go on this. Okay. We're just uh You can see the, the fire burning. Oh yeah. Woo! Oh yeah. Boy, that's really that's really boiling. Now, over here, over here is the starting platform, the, it, the controls. It's another one boiler. Another one boiler. Another one. Another two. Another three. Number wow. three. So this keeps track of huh? all the pressure. 45. And these and these are the communication to the bridge. Uh, And then the air, and then the turbines, yeah. turbines. adventure. We saw the actual drive line turns, the propellers that thrust this huge ship forward through the water. Yeah. Power. <laughs> well, that's it for today's show. I hope you enjoyed it. You've been watching Cruising Authority at cruisetalkshow.com. I'm your host, Barry Vaudrin, and I want to wish you smooth seas. Mm -hmm.